Joselin, how are you? Is everything good? All good. Are we prepared to visit Carmen? Yes, everything is arranged. Speak with her? Yes. Okay, let's leave. Let's go over there. Hello, Carmen. Nice to meet with you. Were you waiting for us? Yes, good. Are you ready for the interview? Okay. Good. And briefly explain about the process before you began with the greenhouse. What was there before? We worked on an irrigation project that the committee built for the development of the community. We are going to build a small greenhouse for the women. It was first built out of bamboo. And what was your first impression when you first started to produce there? Well, for us it was something wonderful because we never had known about this type of technology nor the other people that had greenhouse. We were the first to have a greenhouse then the production was very good we saw that there were no diseases inside and since it rained we could even work when it rained. What do you think that the men of the community felt when they were presented with a project like this and that you were progressing and had certain success? What was their reaction at that moment? We had problems because you know that the majority of men are chauvinists at least in these rural areas where we live, and they don't want the women to exceed them. After you overcame these barriers, do you think the community of men are more accepting? Clearly, they have seen the benefits, and many of them have helped us with the work. Today, in actuality, how do you see the project? The project is much better, more productive, uh, less diseases and now we feel good about the project. What are your goals? What would you like to see the project attain or accomplish? To have more greenhouses to integrate other women that up till now are not integrated in jobs and maybe these women haven't joined because they see that the greenhouses that we have aren't as productive for so many women. The economic aspect, in other words, have you seen the project has brought an opportunity to improve your income? To have access to credit, something we didn't have before. Now at least, with the committee for development that we attend, and since we're in good standing with them, we can ask for whatever we need. We feel proud in working with the technicians of Adesco because they are always active with us with all that is about the cultivation and also with the people from farmer to farmer. We feel very close with them because it has been an extraordinary experience because of what we have learned from them. Tell us what is your message for the rest of the women that are in the project? To those who would like to incorporate themselves with the project, what is your message to them? To become involved in the work, the production, and to become knowledgeable with this greenhouse technology and that together we can achieve much because we now have more experience that we can share with all of the other women. Well, Carmen, thank you very much for everything and I wish you victory and from my own personal name and also the Foundation for Development, Adesso, we are very grateful and we give you thanks for your efforts. Thank you.